The Booker T. Washington Public Charter School for Technical Arts offers an, an adult evening program. The evening program consists of core curriculum, HVAC, plumbing, electrical wiring, stationary steam engineering, an evening high school recovery program, and ABE and GED. The most sought after program is our stationary steam engineering program where adults are equipped to receive their third or sixth class license. Our long range goal is to become a third class stationary engineer. I'm trying to get that sixth class engineer and then with the program they have here, you know, they, they'll enable you to get your, your third and even your first. To give us a lot more learning experience with boilers and chillers and all that kind of good stuff to help us help better prepare us to acquire our six class DC license. We're taking this class to help obtain our license and from doing so I've got my license from the help here and then uh, I want to take the other for my third so I can have a place to retire. The program we got here at uh, Booker T. Washington is that uh, <clears throat> we have what we call a low pressure stationary engineering program. That's the beginner's level. And what we try to do is uh, bring people in that's coming in the field on the entry level. And uh, we bring them up to uh, so they'll be able to take their uh, sixth class District of Columbia stationary engineers license exam and that's the uh, beginner's license here in the District of Columbia. There's some things that I didn't know anything about relating to uh, the uh, working on boilers or the operation of boilers, uh, mechanical, uh, uh, the functions and everything uh, relating to the safety of operating a boiler system. Uh, it's a lot to it, and you have to be diligent, you got to be steadfast, and you can't do like I did last summer and stop looking in the books, right? The school was over last summer, I didn't look at the books, so I'm back here again, but I got it now. I got it down. But what we, what as a stationary engineer does, they manage all your big buildings here in the district, the office buildings, your hospitals, colleges, uh, big power plants. Any building that you see here in the District of Columbia, they have to have a, a stationary engineer in there with a DC license. And uh, this is my second year in steam engineering uh, and it's greatly enhanced my uh, future prospects for employment and what I desire to do in a career. Hopefully one day when people when the old people start retiring from geographic, there'll be a position to, <laughs> there'll be a position for us to move up and become a licensed engineer. Once you get employed, you're starting out on the entry level at least about $20, $25 an hour as a sixth class engineer. And then the next program we have is the high pressure program, which is built on uh, from the low pressure uh, program. You, if you successfully uh, pass that exam, you can come out there making $40, $45 an hour. Uh, and the demand for stationary engineers, especially here in the District of Columbia, is very, uh, they are, are in demand. You have a lot of people that's retiring and, uh, and they gotta be replaced by other, uh, engineers coming on. Not, it's not readily available too much in this area at all. So what I'm saying is if you can get in, you're fortunate. And then you know you make it work for you, make it do what it do. You know, that's it. I'm glad and I'm grateful for the class uh, that uh, I had the opportunity to be a DC resident to, to, to participate and um, just participate in, in, in a class that I didn't have to pay a lot of amount to take this same course elsewhere. A lot of people have uh, 
tried to recruit me from this institution to go teach for them, but uh, I have made a dedication to stay here and to help uh, others to be successful. So uh, <clears throat> I have a understanding of how to teach uh, the students. Some of them have problems, they say, uh, with the math. But I tell them, if you can count money and you're not brain dead, we can work with you. And, and then we just break it on down and just build them on up. And then when they leave out here, they're ready to uh, meet that challenge in the world. Uh, got a great teacher. Uh, it's, uh, uh, it's very uh, enlightening. I mean, you learn a lot of things, and you, you strengthen other parts of your of your subject matter, such as your math and what have you, and your logic. And uh, it's just been a good place. The teacher's real good, and he's pretty thorough. He goes through it pretty hard. It's kind of tough, but you got to be tough to get educated.